Hello everybody, this is Jacob Nolly with the Graphite Lab, and in today's video, I'm going to show you how to make a custom modular dashboard inside of Service Titan with reports that you've created inside of the Reports tab in Service Titan. So the first part of this video, what you're going to have to have done up to this point is have reports inside of your Reports tab, especially if you want custom reports that Service Titan just doesn't dump in uh, by default. Once you've gone ahead and created those reports, which we do have tutorials for those as well, um, what you're going to do is you're going to come over here, um, you're going to go to the, your dashboard tab in Service Titan, and you're going to go down to create a dashboard. This is going to allow you to create a dashboard um, of your choice um, using different types of modules that Service Titan has available to us. So we're going to go ahead and just call this a jobs dashboard. Even though this is just an example, and we'll just be adding random reports to it, we'll just call it a da jobs dashboard. And what we'll have is sections and we'll have um, we'll have uh, the ability to add reports up here. So the first thing that we're going to do is add a module and we're going to go ahead and add a report. Then we're going to grab a template report. So we're gonna go ahead and grab a jobs report and it's going to show us the different reports in that template that we have available to us. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and grab this jobs created in the last month report, which we've made in a previous video. And I'm gonna go ahead and add that here. And you'll see that that go ahead, goes ahead and inherits the, the, the settings that we had in that report. Now we're going to go ahead and add a few other uh, reports in here. So um, since this is a jobs um, report, we're going to go ahead, let's just go ahead and add some more jobs reports. So maybe we'll add this job detail by CSR report. We'll just go ahead and keep the defaults. We'll go ahead and add another one. Let's see here. Let's go ahead and do the install revenue by campaign report. It gives us some details about that. Let's keep the defaults again. Let's go ahead and add a couple more. Or go ahead and add another jobs report. And we'll do upcoming jobs report. Add, and then lastly, let's just mix it up a little bit and add an estimate based report. So we'll go ahead and click estimates and we'll do this opportunity and estimates report all right so we've got our reports built out added in here and what we're going to go ahead and do is just click save save and this is going to go ahead and save our jobs dashboard here with all of these different report metrics here and then all we have to do to, uh, to pull these reports, um, this is a test account, so there isn't actually data for a lot of these, um, but all we have to do to pull the reports is either refresh it manually or have it automatically refresh every 10, 30, 10 minutes, 30 minutes, or every hour. Um, but yeah, so this is how you build a custom dashboard inside of Service Titan based on different reports that you've built inside of the Service Titan reports tool.